I'm Trina and thanks for watching my nail diary for Nell's Next Top Nail Artist Challenge 6. This week we were asked to create our own monogram fashioned after Koopa's cute monogram. So I took my business name, Oh Snap, Oh Snap, and took the initials O and S and created like a twisted artistic heart. I wanted my monogram to have that feeling of nail love. I'm going to show you how I did it. Let's go. After a few tries, I decided to make the S wrap around the O, making that heart shape. In figuring out the shape, I decided on a stiletto wire extension set of press-ons with acrylic overlay. The wire extensions are in the shape of the monogram. For the thin coat of overlay, I used Koopa's Structure Acrylic and their 3D Nail Art Monomer. That monomer is perfect if you love your acrylic to set quickly, like I do. I used to do press-ons for a few years starting back in 2016 before they blew up during quarantine. Having an acrylic overlay on the press-ons are like having the real deal extensions. After the acrylic is laid and the extensions are all filed, then we can plan how we want our final design and final shot placement to be. To create the diagonal velvety material strip, start out by outlining the space. Add any color background you want. I chose a glittery red. After the striping tape is laid, then we use Koopa's dip with a sugaring technique. Although the sugaring technique is not the traditional way to use the dip, it worked out perfectly because the powder is so fine and it really pops, looking like true material. This set had a vintage feel to it so let's add some old school saddle shoe inspired accent nails. I love doing the widow's peak. Koopa's signature colors, red, white, and black, are the inspo behind our color scheme this week. I love how Koopa has a LED adhesive. It's easy to clean as the dip lightly stays in place. And because of its lower viscosity, you can get more detailed art with it. Let's make monogram charms for the ring nail made from adhesive, dip powder, and reinforced with Enrich RX Builder. You can add some pearls to further accentuate the vintage vibe. For teeny tiny monogram print, I used a fine point sharpie, then reinforced with gel paint. You can't remove sharpie, so you have to be very careful. To top off the monogram set, let's make a charm bracelet. This is monogram madness. Use Enrich RX Builder and the glitter of your choice to make durable charms. Layer it in three or four layers on both sides for best durability. The last step in this set is to link the charms together.
After you measure the bracelet and close it up, it's ready to wear. Thank you so much for watching. Aloha.